It was never easier to start a new Laravel project with React and use the best of both worlds together. Actually, you can say it's a breeze now because of Laravel Breeze, which is one of Laravel starter kits that recently added React support. So how does that work, you might ask? Let's take a look together. So here inside Laravel's documentation, you can find this part starter kits. And as I mentioned, Laravel Breeze is one of the two main starter kits that you can have with your level installation. And as you can see, Breeze supports Blade, Livewire, but also React and Vue. And this is what we are interested in. So let's take a look. So Level Breeze offers React and Vue scaffolding via an Inertia frontend implementation. So what does this mean? Inertia is a level package that you can install in order to use your favorite JavaScript framework like Vue or React and connect it to your Laravel application in order to use all the features that Laravel has to offer for you inside a single page application. So this means you don't have to create two different applications and connect them somehow through an API. Inertia has the power to glue those tools together. All right, but enough of the docs, let's try it out together. I'm going to create a new Laravel application through the Laravel installer and here we have this nice UI to do that. So the name of our project will be Level Breeze React. We want to use Level Breeze as the starter kit. And as you can see here, we can define what we want to use. And in our case, we want to use React with inertia. You also got an option to use TypeScript if you want to, but for this demo, we don't do this. Let's use past and we don't need a Git repo. At the end, Lab will also ask you if you want to use a specific database and we are going to go for a SQLite one here for this demo. Before we check out the code, let's take a look at the website right now. So this is what a fresh level installation always looks like. This is the welcome page, but on the top right, you can see here, we already have links here for logging and for register. And so this is what level breeze comes with an authentication system for you to log in to register and to also have a little user profile. But before we can use this, we also need to check the code and also run our migrations. So this is our level breeze installation. The first thing we're going to do is run our migrations, PHP artisan migrate. And it also asks us if we want to create a new database SQLite file, which we don't have yet. And yes, we want to do this. And this now runs our migrations, perfect. As a result, we should now be able to register and create a new user. So let's try this also together. Register, Christoph, my email address and the super secure password. And here we go, we're locked in. You can see we're now here at the dashboard. We also have here our nice little profile where we can also adapt some of our data, like our name, email, or change the password. So this also comes with level breeze. And we can of course also log out if we want to. That's pretty cool already because we haven't done or we didn't have to do so much in order to get this little application that we can already work on from. But of course, we're here talking about React, so let's take a look at how that works. So the first page that we have seen was the welcome page, which you will find under Fuse Welcome here, and this is a normal Blade file. But here under JS, you can see now that we also have different pages here, and these are the ones that come for React. So there's this new welcome file here, but there's also the dashboard, which we have seen before. And for authentication, we also got a login, register page, and all the pages that you need to come here for React. And then similarly to your normal level application with Blade, you also got layout files here, and you also got here all the different components for things to reuse in React. And this all is glued together by Vite, so let's run this as well, starting here our application server. And now since this is running, of course, we also got hot reloading, so let's take a look at the dashboard page. And let's here change some text here. You're locked in now. And as you can see, it already was changed here on our side as well without a refresh, which of course is great for developing. And now here with Breeze and React, you got your perfect starting point for working with React and Devil. And from here on, you can take your application to anywhere you want it to be. That's how simple it is to get started with Laravel and React. If you haven't tried Breeze with React yet, you really should. So give it a try and let us know. Have fun.